Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Just a quick little update. We are officially in full swing pre-emergent mode here at Matthews Landscape. Uh, most people, when they think about fall time pre-emergence, they think about fall and winter weeds. And while you are right, it does prevent these winter weeds, what most people fail to remember or don't realize is when you look at the bigger picture, and we talk about being proactive all the time, these fall pre-emergence that you need to apply right now, that's what's going to help you with your weeds that are gonna pop up later on in the year in the early spring. I'm talking the weeds that you typically see around that uh, February, March, April time frame. Whenever you see weeds popping up, those are winter weeds. What happens is, is they germinate over the winter months and then as the temperatures start to warm up for the spring, boom, they explode. And then you get a yard full of weeds. So. When you see yards, uh, I'm gonna say in you know February, March, April, when you see yards that are chock full of weeds, it's because they missed their fall time pre-emergent and all those are winter weeds. As soon as things warm up, they're gonna burn off and they're gonna go away. If you don't do your spring pre-emergence, you're gonna get left with summertime weeds then. So remember that uh, you gotta stay proactive, you gotta stay ahead of the game. You want to put down your pre-emergence well in advance so that whenever that germination process starts, uh, you've got your pre-emergence in the ground. It's going to stop that process and you're going to end up with a weed-free yard. So if you got any questions, let us know. You need to start thinking about it now. You need to start being proactive, start getting those pre-emergence down. If you got any questions, we look forward to hearing from you. Y'all have a good day.